So now I'm going to go over how to create a compound object. Creating compound objects are useful when you have images with two or more, co more components. Take, for example, a postcard. Here I have two sides of a postcard. However, each one is its own separate object. So here's the front, and here's the back. However, I would like to combine that into one single object. So, how do I do that? Well, first I have to find the PID for each object. So to do that, I'm going to go to the Manage tab of each side of the postcard. I'm then going to go to Data Streams. And here's the PID for the front side. So it's good to write this down because you will need it when creating the compound object. So the PID for the first side is 20,002, followed by a colon, and then 923-848-056. So there's the first PID that I will need. Now I have to find out the PID for the second side. So I go to the Manage tab for the back side of the postcard. Data Streams again. And here's that PID, which is 20,002, followed by a colon, then 923, 848-054. So once I've written down both PIDs, I go back to my collection. I will then click on Manage, and then add an object to this collection. For Content Model, I'm going to select Compound Object Content Model, and I can then click Next. This brings me to the Mods form for the Compound Object. Now keep in mind, I'm just going to sort of steam line, streamline the process and just fill out the necessary metadata fields. You should, however, try to fill in as much as possible that is applicable to your object. So I'm just going to enter in some title information. Resource type is already set at still image, so I could leave it as is. Digital origin is set to reformatted digital, so I could leave it at that. For held by, I'm just going to enter in CTDA. And then I'm just going to put no known copyright restrictions for the rights. I can then click on ingest. Now this creates the parent of the collection, that is, which contains the children or each individual side of the postcard. So then, to add each side, I'm now going to click on Manage. I'm then going to go to the top right and select Compound. Now here is where I add the PID of each side of the postcard, one at a time. So here I'm going to enter the first side, which is 20,002, which is then followed by a colon, and then 923-848 and 056. After I've entered the PID, I'm then going to click on Save. And then I enter the PID for the second side. So that is 20,002, which is then followed by a colon, then 923, 848, 054. And then I click Save again. So now, if I go to View, Here's my compound object that contains both sides of the postcard. So there's the front side, and if I click on the thumbnail to the right here, I can also view the back side. And that is how you create a compound object.